Alright. So, today I'm going to show you guys how to <clears throat> make your little, uh, to create your own slider mask. And as you can see, it kind of matches my background, what goes through. So, I mean, I made this whole theme also. But, I'm going to teach you guys how to do this. You guys are going to need to know how to use Qt FTP, and you're going to need to know, uh, how to download uh, customize because that's where I save everything so just go down highlight mask and uh, those are the ones I've made so far that's the one that I have on right now okay so I'm gonna show you how to use uh, make them on the computer I'll show you guys how to use cute FTP so, you're going to want to go, alright, so let's say we start all the way back here, go to var, root, library, scroll down to customize, and then you're going to want to go to mask slider images, and you can click on backup or boss cube, but take one of those, and uh, just double click it, so... Right now we have one called Pulse. Let's see, drag that one down here. Okay, so I'm just going to take that, open it with paint. Let's see, I'm going to get a bigger image there. We'll zoom it to 800. So, now we can just say, let's say you want your thing to be red. Take that, delete. Delete, um, dump in red, full color red. Let's say you want the inside. So you want the inside to be black. So dump in black. And then just keep cutting it out to uh, however you want. So I'm just going to throw another layer of red in there. Alright, so that's what our little dock icon is going to look like. Just take it, hit save. Okay, you can exit out. And that's our image we have right there. So take this image, you're going to want to drag it down into Qt FTP. The screen is going to pop up. Then just drop it right back in. And it's going to ask you do you want to replace the existing file? So just hit yes. Or hold on one second. I'm rename that file. And drag it back in. And right now it's saving. So now go back into your iPod Touch. Go to customize. Scroll down to highlight mask, and that's the one that we just made. Oops, not that one. That one right there. That's the one that we just made. Hit OK. Exit. It's going to restart. And there you have it. That's our little sliding icon. So, that is how you make your own mask slider. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks.